Hey guys, um, it looks like there's like a new TV spot, I think, for Mockingjay Part 1. And yeah, I'm going to react to it. Okay, I would have had this video up a few days ago when it was was, was released, but um, the Wi-Fi, it stopped working for a while. It j we just got it back up working today. Thank goodness, I would it would have been terrible to uh, spend the whole weekend with no Wi-Fi, but... Yeah, so, it, like, you're getting this video, and you're getting three other videos today. Sorry for the spam, but but now the Wi-Fi is back on, so starting next week, it, the video schedule will, will be the same. It's just today, you're getting all the videos I want to do out today. And then on Sunday, you're going to get Walking Dead Season 2 review. I mean, Season 5, Episode 2 review. So, yeah. And also, for this video... I'm going to be wearing, for this reaction, watching this video, I'm going to wear headphones because last time I got a copyright notice because you could hear the trailer music for, for this trailer, for like the Mockingjay trailer. So I don't want to have another one, so just for this video, I'm going to be wearing my headphones in when I watch it. Sorry, I know that sucks, but okay. And... All right, Ugh. I'm starting it. Okay, it's, uh, wow! So basically that was just, uh, the whole thing, video was her going to District 12 after it's been bombed. First of all, they were playing the Yellow Flicker Beat song by Lord in the trailer, and like at first when I heard it I was like, huh, I didn't know what to think about it, and now I see it with the trailer I'm like, wow, that actually really, like, goes together. Um... <laughs> But yeah, this whole video is her going back to District 12, and first of all, it it looks so cool. It looks like a a town that actually got bombed. It doesn't look fake. It looks beautiful. And yeah, it it looks just like I would have pictured it in my head. I haven't read the book in a long time, and I was thinking maybe I'd have to reread it. I mean, I started rereading it a few months ago, and then I stopped, but... But yeah, huh. well, yeah, but that's really all that happened. But wow, like, it looks so cool. Just, ugh. And then, like, when, and we see Katniss going through her house, the only thing that's still, well, the uh, Victor's Village houses are the only houses that are still intact. And we see her go, and we see, see her get the hunting jacket and picture of her father. And then we see her go into the study, and we see that one white rose that uh, Snow intentionally left for her. And, um, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, this is a great ta trailer. I guess it will be a TV spot. <sighs> Guys, we have, I think it's 34 days until the movie comes out. Like... Yay, I am so excited, like, like, seriously, like, and, ugh, like, waiting for Catching Fire last year was torture, because we had to wait not only, we only didn't have to wait a year, like, we had to wait over a year and a half, though the payoff was very sweet, 
And I, literally, I started the countdown like a ye- until like a year before the movie started. Like I think actually, I think I started the countdown at like 400 days before Catching Fire came on. Yeah, I know I was obsessed. <laughs> but yeah, this time I only started the countdown 100 days before, and the wait has been not as torturous. I mean, obviously Catching Fire is my favorite book, but so that's why the wait was so like oh my gosh, excruciating. But now, but it doesn't mean I still don't want to see this. I'm, but like, yeah, I'm so excited. <sighs> but yeah. But thankfully, there are movies I am ex- getting to see before it, like uh, Fury, to, I'm seeing later this afternoon, and um, Interstellar. And yeah, there are still, yeah, there are a few movies I'm seeing before this movie comes out. So, yeah. Okay, I will have another video up soon. So I'm sorry about the spam. Once again, I apologize. But I couldn't help it, the Wi-Fi. So, yeah. I will see you later. Bye.